Well, here it is, guys. I know y'all been waiting a long time to finally see what I went and got. We built this whole big enclosure for him. We got him. I think this is going to be awesome. He's got a big basking area so he can get on, you know, get him some sunshine. Check out that water bowl right there. I mean, he should have plenty of room in that water bowl, wouldn't you think? Well, <laughs> I sure hope you guys know me better than that. But stay tuned. We'll show you what's really going in here. What's going on, guys? We're here. We made it. We're in Columbia. We're just waiting for this line to shorten up some. It's cold outside. Uh, we got here for the VIP, but as you can see, that line, hopefully you can see that back there. So we're going to sit here until it calms down. But stay tuned. It's going to be cool. What's going on, guys? We're here at the show and with Matt. And uh, I know you've been waiting for this. I'm going to show you the critter. He's got it right up on his head right there. This is our newest addition. I know I've, I've kept y'all hanging for a long time on that. Especially you, Mr. Harry. You've been asking me over and over what it is. So here it is. Check it out. What you think? <laughs> oh, man. He is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Sweet stuff. All right. Stay tuned for more. we got more to show y'all. just wanted to get that clip. Stay tuned. Awesome. Awesome. Here you go, Sal. I found your blue tree monitor. Got it right here for you. That's what you requested. Well, there it is. A thousand bucks. He's every bit worth it, though. Gorgeous. Very gorgeous. Uh, got a blue, and then a mangrove, and then a green. Beautiful, beautiful lizards. Man, we got so much stuff here. It is insane. Oh, Mata Mata. It's one of my favorite turtles. Awesome. Go back. All your spiders. It might. They sell it for $10 a bag. Probably. Oh, big siren. Something you don't see too often. Oh man, there's your mamba. Man, insane. You can find everything at the show. Bush Viper, really cool. Tiger. Turtles. Ooh, beautiful. Man. Oh, Lord, it kills me. It sucks living in Georgia, dude. Very pretty. That's yeah, just phenomenal. Cobra, not for sale. Baby's available. Oh man, an albino cottonmouth. It's not something you see every day. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Reptiles, don't they? I'm guessing. 
more Cobras. Where the black dude come from? 
So it wasn't him? Uh-uh. It's just a guy with a black dirt coming over here. Okay, well that's gonna make him feel better. Yeah, it does. No, but he did help me that day. Yeah, see, look at the price of these. How y'all doing? Good, how are you? Good. Some pretty crested you have there. Yeah, it's a pretty spider. Very pretty. They always lose their tails when they breed, don't they? Um, they lose their tails for several reasons. I still have a bunch that have them for stress, for, you know. Right. They're really awesome, though. Yeah. They really are cool guys. Man, gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sumatran water. Yeah, I mean, there's a little. So far, I think we've got the best stuff. They're the best price. I'm definitely not disappointed. Me neither. Oh, man, look at this big Mata Mata. Giant one. Yeah, that's his too. The bottom on them? Yeah. Yeah, I they breed them. I love believe. it. Let's go over here. Pretty hog nose. Here we go. Yeah, 35 bucks. It's not quite as big there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Excuse me, buddy. Uh, hey. What you mean? It was just some kind of funky looking lizard. He had like some red color to him. That's it. Huh? Your crested is right. It's the prettiest one I've seen. I guess we're going to end up with this crested. This one? Yeah, I guess we will. <laughs> Add it to our collection for today. He is a, he, <laughs> oh, that's so cool. He's a cool one. He's still got his tail and all. 80 bucks. And those sirens are awesome. Yeah. They are awesome. This is something you don't see often. But. That's cool. What is that? What? Tree dragon. Keep doing what you're doing, Matt. I'm just getting a shot of the back of your shirt there, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Reptile passions here. Just Matt. Oh, yeah, that's a good one, too. Yeah, check him out. He's got stuff just even built into him. Look at that. Here's some great people here, guys, at Reptile Passions. Uh, Mr. Matt, Jonathan, they really, really made it happen for us this year. Really, really tickled about it. And, uh, can't wait, can't wait to get home and get all this stuff. We got boxes and stuff here for you this year. Really pumped, guys. Really pumped. Okay, never mind. Here with Jonathan at Reptile Passions. He really made it happen this year. If you guys are at the show, you'll need to check him out. He's got some great stuff. He had the best selection of stuff here, the most healthy animals. Um, anything you'd like to say? No, nah, we appreciate it. Hey, man, I'll come back out and see if you need anything we'll see else. You next time. All right, man. Appreciate it, bud. Check your shirt. Reptile Passions right there. Yeah, Check them out. It. Enjoy you yourselves, guys. Yeah, man. Thank you now. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Before we go, I have to ask. What? See how much you can get two of those clowns for. Hey, guys. Yeah, we're just leaving the reptile show. See you later, Jamel Temple. And we're heading home. We got a pile of cool stuff to uh, unbox and show you guys when we get to the house. Um, I hope I got enough video for y'all this time. Uh, it was really hard to do, it's harder than you think, walking through all them people, but I tried to get some venomous. And uh, Sal, I got your picture of your blue tree monitor. 
It was a thousand bucks. Hope you enjoy that. And um, we'll catch you here in a minute. Thanks, guys. All right, so now we're gonna move him from my bathtub because I had to make some uh, adjustments to his enclosure. Um, gonna move him out and take the dinosaur and put him in his, in his permanent home for now. Come on, buddy. Oh! All right, let's have this blanket and wrap him. So he's got water dripping everywhere. <laughs> I'm gonna get to the side of that. Ugh. Come on with it. Uh -oh. oh, watch his head. Watch his head. Ugh. Oh. He's pretty heavy. <laughs> Hey, what you think about this? Uh, 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 uh. No thanks. <laughs> Come on. I like the lizard, but I like Come to keep on, my cats in the process. Huh? I said I like the lizard, but I like to keep my cats in the process. Yeah. Man, it's cold out here, I know. Oh, you know it is. I know it is. Here, just lay that down. Ooh. Get Nancy. Alright. This is your home. Near home. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's a big enough water bowl, I believe. Well, there he is, guys. In his home, my new addition, my ginormous Asian water monitor. I am really tickled with this guy. He is perfect. All of his fingers and toes. Yep, they got all my fingers and toes. My tail is completely intact. This guy has been raised from a baby. And uh, I am very fortunate to have been able to get him. And I really appreciate it there, uh, Jonathan McMillan. Um, he made it all happen. But he's got his basking spot. And I've got a, what they call a pig blanket coming. I uh, should be here Monday for him. Kind of give him some really good belly heat. But he's got all that. And it's big water bowl I put the drain in there for him so if he decides to use it as a litter box I can go right up underneath and pull it right out well, there he is <laughs> well y'all stay tuned I got some more stuff for you uh, from this part I guess uh, do a, another part of the video and um, show you the rest of the critters we picked up today so i hope y'all enjoyed that and uh, i'm tickled tickled to be the proud owner of this guy he is a very awesome specimen and i really hope he's happy in here is that right a really good and tamed monitor he's taken to shows um kids play with him and he is just gorgeous. Man, what a gorgeous, gorgeous monitor. <laughs> Stay tuned. All right, guys. I was going to show you the rest of our spools um, from the reptile show today. You didn't see the big thing, so here's all of our smaller stuff and kind of not so smaller stuff, but... Uh, my first thing here, I have me a Goody Metallica ornamental. Beautiful, beautiful spider he's hid away in there. Uh, there's his molt where he had just molted, but really, really pretty spider. I wish he was out. Of course, when I'm filming, he's going to be hid away. The next one I got, you can't see it, but it's a King Baboon. Um... It's just a little bitty sling. He's down buried in that cup. I'm going to have fun getting him out. Uh, the next, 
and I'll just peek you in on him because I got the cats around me if we were to jump down, is our frill dragon. Hey, buddy. I'm sure we'll have fun in a, another video getting him to, to show us that frill. Uh, next little guy in here is a pixie frog. And these guys get huge. I cannot wait till he starts growing. It's a little baby pixie frog. My wife has been wanting one of these. So this is hers. It is our new crested gecko. Really pretty little crested gecko. Uh, we have a budgets frog. Screaming frog or Freddy Cougar frog. And if you see the bandage, I was trying to hurry up and finish the monitor enclosure and I put a drill bit uh, through my hand. So yeah, a lot of fun there. Well, oh, let me set the camera down. Domino, leave me alone, buddy. There's a little budgets frog. Which I thought was awesome, awesome find. That was another one uh, that my wife has really, really been wanting for a while. Finally got a hold of one. I think they call him a Freddy Cougar frog, too, or something. And, uh, a well, not the last one. I got one more, but uh, this is a Saranam toad. I had one of these when I was a kid. I got to get him in the water. Another get a shadow out of there. Another really, really awesome find today at the show. There's some really cool little frogs right there. And the last ones we got, and we done put them up in here. You can see that guy in there. And there's one right there. Those are Amazon milk frogs. And I got to get their top a little bit more secured so that, uh, Keep that humidity up on them guys. Yep. Well, that was all of our critters that we got uh, from the show. We really had a good time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, appreciate the uh, anticipation on what it was going to be. And uh, especially you, Harry. You, you're a trooper, man. Um, so this video, uh, just trying to get it out there as quick as I could to kind of show y'all what we got. And... Uh, Sal, I got your blue tree monitor. Also, I'm sure that uh, you enjoyed that earlier on in the video in a clip. And I'm sorry that the clips are kind of spontaneously um, strung together, but I got what I could while we was at the show. And um, I want to give another shout out to uh, to Jonathan McMillan, um, uh, Passion Reptiles. Really, really good stuff. They had they had awesome stuff this year. He uh, he really looked out for me and got everything we had asked for ahead of time and uh, plus some. The monitor is just amazing. I am I'm so tickled about that monitor. It's, uh, it's definitely my biggest um, one I've ever had. And uh, I hope he has many, many years of, uh, of good life and longevity because and, he sure, uh, sure makes me happy. So as always, I appreciate you watching and uh, I'm sure we'll be getting through and doing a video on all these guys individual and care and setups and but as for right now i'm gonna get to work because i got a lot of work to do and uh get these guys housed where they need to be so until next time we'll see you then thanks for watching i had to get y'all a short clip of this i almost forgot about that guy yeah, i got this for my son to go in his frog tank that is his albino bullfrog don't really see too many of those. It's really neat to, to see one. He's got that one. This is Nubby that we had got from a cat. He only has one leg. If you can see his little nub there, but he gets along fine. Uh, he hadn't had a leg since he was much bigger than a, you know uh, juvenile frog, or whatever. But want to take a second and show y'all that one. Forgot to include it. He's in there with some little turtles and stuff. I really soft shell. Really got to do something in their tank is looking awful, but didn't want to leave them out.